What's up everyone? Today we're going to be going over Elite Code 532, K different pairs. Pretty much we're given an array. Pretty much we're given an array and they want us to find the unique pairs whose absolute difference is going to be the K that they give. Now, there might be duplicates so we can't have 1 3 and 1 3 and we can't have 3, 5, and, and 5, 3. So the way I approach this problem is by using a custom class called pairs. And the way I kept track is I used a map where the key is the integer. So this would be 35. And I would only create pairs in ascending orders. This would be, for example, 13. And that would be the key. And that would be the, uh, that would be the key. And that would be the value. So this way, all we have to do is return the size of the map. So the pair class looks like this. Now, now that we have that, all we have to do is create a map, key integer, values pair, map, new, hash map. Now we're going to be storing in there. So for int i equals zero, i is less than arr dot length and then i plus plus for j into j equals zero j is less than r dot length j plus plus if i is equal to j and continue because we can't have three comma three as a coordinate or a pair rather um, now how did I put it? I think I put it something like, if this was, first we have to create the pair. If, um, if ARR of I is less than ARR of J, then, then um, pair P is going to be new, here, ARR of I, comma, ARR of J, else, pair, P is new, pair, ARR of J, comma, ARRR of I. Okay, then we make sure that once that pair is created, so 13 and 35. So if ARR of I is less than ARR of J, then map dot put ARR of I times 10 plus ARR of J comma mm, okay this actually needs to go in here so we put that in there and here I would put map dot put ARR of I times 10 plus ARR of J and then P the same thing here, else map dot put ARR of J times 10 plus ARR of I comma P. That's the inner for loop, outer for loop, and then we all we have to do is return map dot size. And we'll get two because this will only get stored in 
ascending order. That's how I solved Likode 532.